What's up guys? Welcome back. It's your number one glutton mad attack. Today I picked up myself some Domino's. I just got myself two pizzas this time around, no sides because uh, that's all I was craving. But I got myself a ch barbecue chicken pizza and I get then a large pepperoni pizza. Now, uh, mediums look pretty small. Maybe I should have got two large. If I wasn't going to get any sides with that, but whatever. What's that? Oh, don't drop it. Let's get rid of one of these boxes. I haven't actually had Domino's in like forever, so I didn't know like what the pizzas, like the sizes would look like, to be honest. Let's get some, there we go. That's going to be good. And some sauces out. What do we got here? There we go. Mm. Maybe I should have got my sauces and stuff prepared ahead of time. Just so I wouldn't be so it wouldn't be so time consuming. But oh well. So I got some garlic and some ranch here. And then I actually have, I have a few, a couple, eh, a f yeah, I got a few, a few barbecues left over from some of my, some of my McDonald's meals. I might use, try to use those up. So yeah, so this pepperoni actually has normal pepperoni and Brooklyn pepperoni on it because it was a four topping pizza. So I thought instead of getting extra pepperoni, why don't I actually just get some Brooklyn pepperoni on there with that? Mm. That is so good. Let's dip it in some ranch. Here we go. So I actually ordered this pizza ahead of time the night before last night. I didn't pay for it. I, I opted to pay for it in the store when I went to pick it up. But I went back online onto the Domino's website the next day, so today. And I saw they started an offer for for this week, all all pizzas fifty percent off when ordered online. I'm like, oh my god, seriously! So I called them up though, though, and they were able to sort it all out and change my order. So I got so I got these pizzas both half off. Don't you just hate it when something like that happens? That happened to me when I got my PS4. I think like I bought my PS4 and then a month later they announced the PS4 Slim, which was like 150 or 200 dollars cheaper than the version I got. That sort of stuff seems to always happen to me though. Still some DQ napkins left over. Okay, let's go with the barbecue chicken next. Mm. I actually want, wanted to try their chicken taco and cheeseburger pizza that they came out with. But I had one of those moments where I was like, 
I wasn't too sure. I'm like, oh, am I gonna like order this and be disappointed? And like knowing if I just ordered what I knew I like, I would have been happy. And especially like I was looking at reviews and like not a lot, not a lot of people were saying they're all that great. Especially when I watched Steven Sushi's video on them. And since he's like the king of dominoes, obviously, he said they weren't all that great. But I'm of the opinion that you should always try something for yourself. Because one thing you don't like, someone else might like. And one, one thing someone else doesn't like, you might like. I find that a lot with anime. Some people will give anime, like some animes, a really bad review. And like that anime might turn out to be like one of my favorite of all time. And vice versa. Really popular anime I tend to like, I'll not end up not liking. I know I'll get a lot of flack for it, but I know I don't think like Demon Slayer is all that great. I watched it and it was like, meh, it's alright. Even though I know a lot of people were like just raving about it. I might have to go back and get some Domino's one or two more times this week. Maybe just make this an all Domino's week or something. With that 50% off, you almost can't let go. It's almost too good to let go. Slice of pizza. Let's see. What's your guys' favorite pizzas from Domino's? I haven't actually tried a lot of their feast pizzas. I think this barbecue chicken is my first. That's really good. Actually, like I said I don't eat at Domino's in general very often. I go to Pizza Hut a lot more often, but I probably I'll probably end up switching. Also, if you any, have any recommendations for which kind of sides I should get in the future with my pizza.
Mm. I have a few more dips here. Just in case I ran out. I'm not sure if I want to pick away at a little bit of each or try to finish one off over the other. I'm actually getting pretty full from that. I'm considering, I've considered trying to do, a, uh, I think it's a 27 or 28 inch pizza challenge at a restaurant called Paradiso in my city. A buddy of mine, my sister's boyfriend, said he tried it. And he's a lot bigger than me and I think he can eat a lot more than me. And even he couldn't do it. He had a really hard time with it. He said he was like really close to puking. I believe it too. That's a big pizza. <sighs> well, maybe I'll go with some of this pepperoni. I think just the classic pepperoni is one of my favorite. That and like meat pizzas, like. Like the, what am I trying to say? Meat lovers from Pizza Hut. And I guess Domino's is called the meat cell or something. So I think I gotta open up these other sauces. Come on. Why are you giving me such a hard time? Classic burp going on. Oh. oh yeah, there we go. That's just what I needed. I'm not sure if people like to hear burps or not, or if that grosses them out. I figure if you're already watching a video, listening to someone eat and hearing all the eating sounds, you're not going to mind it anyway, but I don't know. Because I know there are some mukbangers who will like edit out anytime they burp or not. And then you have like Nick Akato who will, who will actually still like leave his farts in. So it goes both ways, I guess. I don't think I'd leave my farts in, that's for sure. I'm definitely nearing my limit. I might only be able to finish this barbecue chicken. Mostly though, I always say that and then I end up getting another burp or something. I 
Sounds like someone's at the door. I'm not getting it though. Someone else can. Ooh. Yeah, I'm not sure. Give it a sec, maybe I'll get a burp. If not, I'll have to leave those three pieces for leftovers or something for another day. Which isn't a bad thing. Who doesn't like leftover pizza? Cold leftover pizza. Mm. Wait. <coughs> oh. There we go. Let's just finish her off. Let's just finish her off. You know you wanna. Now I'll at least finish off the actual pizza part and leave the crust. Hmm, can he do it? <sighs> so that ended up being a lot more pizza than I thought it was. I could probably actually downsize and just go with two mediums. Oh wow. You live and learn. I think I'm at my max, guys. <clears throat> I don't want to force it. I do not want to force it. But I enjoyed that a lot. That was my first Domino's in a long, long time. I can definitely see myself going back again. I want to try, like I see, I, there's a lot of different, um, feast, different feast pizzas that look really good that I want to try. Like the one that caught my eye was like the spinach and feta, I think that one looked good. And maybe like the extravaganza one. I like an all dress kind of pizza too. So who knows? Maybe we'll do another video this week. Maybe next time with a bit of wings or something or cheesy garlic bread. Oh. Who knows? I don't want to keep doing that. I say I'm finished and I keep keep eating. I guess that's why I call myself a glutton. So like, you're full. Stop eating. But I pretty much finished her off. So I'll leave it at that for now. I feel like I never said in a long time in recent videos, but if you like this video, give it a like and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys next time in the next video. Until then, peace out everyone.